Hello, welcome back to Dope Hunts and Rippers. I'm sure you guys remember when I reviewed Exxon Sandy Motor at Rage Fire. A full auto Gatling gun. Good shot. So well, now we have a new blaster that just is ready to collection the Thunder Force Battle Blazer. So, it's a full back chain fed pistol, 12 round chain. So, So, all right, let's talk about this grip though. This grip is back here very painful because it's like very pointy. But other than that, it's a comfortable little blaster. Now, let's talk about the details. 12 round chain. This is how you load the chain in. Pull that back so it kind of loads in like the Mad Maggie Barrel drum. Mad Mega Barrel. Other than that, this is a fun little blaster. Sounds pretty nice too. And final shot. We'll fire it. So, it's got a 12 round chain, pretty nice though, it says Battle Blazer on both sides, it says Buzzy Joys on this side, nothing on that side other than the Battle Blazer, but it's a cool pistol, so yeah, it's pretty fun, so yeah, I like this, although this is the only, only thing I don't like about it is this back of the grip here, very painful. Other than that, it's really cool. No technical rails or anything on it, but it's very easy to work. Prime, pull the trigger. Prime, pull the trigger. This thing is not meant for performance though. This thing is actually shoot. This thing is shooting about 40 feet down range. It's not the most powerful thing, but it's pretty fun. For a barrel blazer, I was expecting about maybe 80, maybe 70, 80 feet down range, but 40 to 45 FPS, no, I was not expecting that down range, the feet down range, I was not expecting that at all, I thought it was going to be a little bit higher, but still a cool pistol during my collection, even my brother said this, that's a cool idea, a chain fed pistol, I thought it was going to be smaller too, $10.57, that's really good. The way it loads. Whoa, what? What? I didn't know it did that. That's cool. So it's you got you do gotta disconnect the belt to take it out. But other than that, still pretty awesome. So this thing are we meant for a more practical thing? No. It's just meant for clinking. It's fun. It's got a smooth prime and everything. It's got a smooth trigger pull. Yeah, it's a pretty fun pistol. I would not use this in a Nerf War, but I would use this for some plinking. It's called a battle blazer. It needs more power to fulfill the prophecy of that name, battle blazer. But it's fun, so yeah. not have slam fire either but it's still a fun pistol so if you want to spend ten dollars and fifty seven cents on this for 40 fps you can i will put the link in the description so you guys can use that if you want to pick up one of these it's actually a very cool blaster i am putting a hand thumb below uncomfortable spot so it can be comfortable so yeah it's a very fun pistol. If you want to get one, go for it. It's very cool. It's something different than what Nerf has. Nerf doesn't have one of these. Adventure Force has it. And it's very fun too. So I gotta give I gotta rate this blaster at a solid four out of ten.
for like performance wise but for looking cool I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10 so if you want a bash that looks cool but has about 40 feet down range 45 feet pick one up and thank you for watching you know, subscribe, subscribe and stay tuned for Monday's review of the Nerf Captain America Side Strike reskin of the Nerf Zombie Strike Side Strike and the review of the Nerf Armor Strike or whatever that orange Side Strike reskin is called but let's get to 2k subscribers and Double Punch Corner out. Peace.